What do you do if you find a gorilla sitting at your school desk? <laughs> Sit somewhere else. <laughs> <laughs> Hello? Ah! <laughs> oh, put me down! Oh, hey! Whoa! Whoa! Oh, that's very good, Basil. Great writing, oh, Basil. Genius, genius, genius! <laughs> Shh, oh, Basil. Basil. Huh? We're trying to concentrate. Oh, I'm sorry, Mole. It's just that what I'm writing here is very funny stuff. It's... It's too difficult. Can I help? Huh? I'm writing a new episode. Seeing as you're asking, <laughs> it's going to be called Basil in Barbados. Featuring me... In Barbados. Brilliant! <laughs> Brilliant! Well, can you keep it to yourself, Basil? We're trying to do homework. Homework? Ah! Oh, in my day, homework was really difficult. <laughs> Not like that stuff you do now. If it's so easy, why don't you do it? All right. <laughs> Square root of. Oh, um. Um. Capital of Mozambique is, um, uh, well, it's, it, well, I, um, uh... <laughs> oh, You can't do it, can you, Basil? <laughs> <laughs> can? It's, uh, it's just that it's all done with computers now, isn't it? <laughs> I'm sorry, Baz, I don't think you can do it. Look at this. Your <laughs> grammar is terrible. <laughs> don't read that. Anyway, what are you, some sort of teacher marking my work? You could do with the teacher, Basil. You should go back to school. Drop it, Mollikins. There's no way you'd get me into it. I have a show to do. <clears throat> no, it's, it's a good idea, Molly. School's a great place to set an episode. Kids love to watch school stuff. Yeah, the location's free, and Basil can brush up on his basics while he's there. Oh, no, 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 no. You'll never get me back in a school uniform. Forget it. No way. Never. No, 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 no. Absolutely not. <laughs> Come on, Basil. We'll be late. Oh, pleasant and correct, Mole. Oh, Basil. Forgot to mention, uniform's not compulsory at our school. <laughs> <laughs> what? Um, I'll go and get changed then, shall I? Too late. <laughs> it's paid for. Uh, uh, wait for me. Uh, oh. Good luck, oh. Basil. <laughs> Quite the young gentleman. <laughs> no. Have you forgotten anything? Oh. <laughs> Yes, to tie up my shoelaces. <laughs> I think that's what you call a school trip. <laughs> boom, boom! <laughs> Wait for me! <laughs> oh, here's another one you like. <laughs> Did you hear about the cross eyed headmaster? <laughs> he couldn't control his pupils. <laughs> <laughs> It's a play on words, you see. Pupils, eyes and pupils. School kids, do you see? Uh, oh, school. It's the head. Oh, oh. Uh, hey, where are you lot going? Brush! Oh, yes, sir. Ah, brush. I'm glad I found you. So, you are the new boy, then? <laughs> One small thing I should mention. While most would agree that I have a good sense of humour, <laughs> I'm not keen on jokers in my school. Do I make myself clear? Oh, yes, sir, perfectly. Me neither. Can't stand jokers. <laughs> Hate them. The silly clowns, all that larking about. And one <laughs> other thing, boy, I can't abide scruffiness. Oh, uh, scruffiness. Awful, isn't it? Messy. <laughs> Understood? Yeah. Good. Now, go to your lessons. Uh, oh. School's closed, Uncle Basil. Oh, why, Bingo? The teacher said there's a nasty bug going round. Je m'appelle Madame Amberly. Et tu, mademoiselle? Je m'appelle Molly, Madame. J'ai 15 ans. 
Asseyez-vous, jeune homme. Comment appelez-vous? Cool. I love it when you talk like that, miss. <laughs> Say it to me all again, would you? Especially that Eppley bit. <laughs> Saying shit is right to me, brash. <laughs> Monsieur Renard, s'il vous plaît. Oh, yeah, oh. Le bon bon. <laughs> blah, blah, blah. Equivalent of which is used for laminated palatoidal limestone. <sighs> Either of the nomenclature schemes may be used. <laughs> you boy! The new boy! You can't fall asleep in my class! <laughs> hey! <laughs> I could if you didn't keep waking me up. <laughs> boom, boom! <laughs> Next question. If I cut two apples and four pears in ten pieces, what will I get? Oh, I know, miss. I know. Okay, Basil. A fruit salad. <laughs> <laughs> boom, boom. <laughs> I'm really good at doing the funny stuff. That's a matter of opinion. <laughs> this homework's got me stamped. Oh, don't worry, Basil. I'll give you a hand with your maths once I finish this quantum physics problem. You don't make me feel really dumb. <laughs> I feel marginally smarter all of a sudden. <laughs> ah, there you go, Bas. A nice cup of tea will make you feel better. Oh, wow! So how was your first day at high school, Basil? I didn't get on too well, Madison. Oh, my gosh. Like, everyone's first day at school is real tough. <sighs> I remember my first day at Valley Girl High. I totally didn't know, like, anyone. And no one seemed to, like, like me. Mm. I remember I got beaten the first day. Those nuns were real strict. You were beaten by nuns? Cool! Basil, did you hear that? Basil? Basil? <laughs> oh, we man's had a busy day. Oh, you'll find it easier tomorrow. <laughs> ah, brush, let's, let's get that cap on straight, shall we now? <laughs> I've decided after yesterday's uh, progress that you might be happier in year three. Oh, promotion already! I knew it! Now, who's in year three? Is it the older kids? The smart ones? <laughs> uh, no, not really. You'll be sitting next to Bingo. <laughs> Bingo? Bingo? Yes, Uncle Basil? Have I got this right? Hmm? Two plus two equals four. Yes, I think so. Oh, I think I'm getting more confident. I can do the sounds. Spelling's much easier. <laughs> Especially the long words. I think I'm beginning to like school. Break time! We can go in the sand pit. Even better. I am absolutely bursting. <laughs> Duke. Oh, come on. Do you actually think I, you know... Bingo! Oh. <laughs> Bingo, this is fun! <laughs> I'm the king of the castle. No, you're not. I am. Right. <laughs> you're not anymore. <laughs> Ooh, somebody stopped me. That's a long way down. <laughs> Whoa, Geronimo! <laughs> That's it, Bingo. Hmm? What a great school. Crisp, pop and jelly babies for lunch. <laughs> no, no, Uncle Bass, no. That's just a snack. <laughs> hey, I can do bigger swings than you, Bingo. You Whoa. Oh. <laughs> what you scared of, Bingo? It's great up here. Whoa. I can't go that high. Don't fall over. Whoa! Oh. Hey, Uncle Bass, Uncle Bass! Uncle Bass, why is it swinging? Yeah. Hold tight, Bingo! What? Whoa. Whoa. Oh. <laughs> oh, that's lunch! Hooray! Ooh, I think I'll have to make a little room. <laughs> uh. <laughs> 
new, Pinku. I have more than 3,000 bones in my body. That's not possible, Uncle Baz. Yes, it is. I've just eaten a tin of sardines for me lunch. <laughs> Basil. Good day? Yeah. See? I told you it would be better. What did you do? Nothing. <coughs> <coughs> Maths and stuff. Hey! Watch where you're throwing your shoes, Basil. <gasps> Basil! You've scuffed these shoes. <laughs> they were new. And look at your school bag. You must have dragged it on the ground all the way home. It was fun. <laughs> what do you think we are? Made of money? <gasps> Basil, you've wrecked them. I'm a school kid. That's my job. <laughs> and if you're going to nag, I'm going to play on my computer. Mm. <laughs> oh, Basil's becoming uncommunicative. Like he says, he's a kid. I'm afraid it's worse than that. Not only is he reverting back to childhood, now he's in Bingo's class. He started a food fight in the canteen. Of course, I usually eat my luncheon in a top restaurant. <laughs> it's called Shea Anil. You may have heard of it. Wonderful international cuisine. Great menu. And, uh... Oi! Who half-inched my pudding? <laughs> Was it you? Was it you? No-one pinches my pudding. <laughs> Know what this means? Food fight. He's also sending love letters to all the best looking girls in the school. I may have a party by new series one or two of you lovely ladies might be interested in. Oh, pick me, Basil. Me. Pick me. No, me, Basil. Pick me. Um, me? Uh, oh dear. And some of their boyfriends are none too pleased. <laughs> Where did we go wrong? Do you really love me most, Basil? Uh, did you mean what you said about my eyes being limpid lagoons of love? Oh, what about what you said about my lovely lips? <laughs> Which one of us do you really love best, Basil? Uh, ladies, ladies, please, I love you all in different ways. He loves me. No, me. I know he really loves me. No, me. Hmm? Me. Me. No, me. <coughs> no, me. It's me. Yeah. It's me. Uh, it's me. That's him. that's been sending love letters to our girlfriends. <laughs> Me? He is. <laughs> Leg it! <laughs> Look who it isn't! Shouldn't you be at school in the middle of the day, Sonny? <laughs> Bang, bang. Oh. Like the uniform, Baz? You look like a right plum in that gap, sunny Jimmy Newt. <laughs> hey, Baz, did you hear the one about the cross-eyed master? Yes, I did, actually. <laughs> Couldn't control his pupils. <laughs> <laughs> I don't get it. Hey. His pupils! His eyes! Eyes, pupils, got it. Come, come here, here. come here, come around here. Have you, you know? really got it? I got it. Explain it to me. Eyeball, it's it's eyeball, you got when you two, two educated fools have quite no, finished, I have to say, I'm rather enjoying school. <laughs> Don't be daft. <laughs> no one likes school. What's not to like? I mean, no responsibilities. You don't have to earn a living or pay tax. You lie in bed in the morning until someone puts breakfast in front of you. There are plenty of pretty girls. Girls? Loads! You play games, you get a free lunch, then you come home and someone makes your tea while you play on the games console. Sweet air. Ah, 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 gotcha! What about homework? Huh. Homework? Copy it from a swap the following morning. Easy peasy. 
Where do we sign up? <laughs> Rush! <Woo. laughs> Oops. Ask him. Why did the chicken get egg spilled from school, eh? Because he kept laying practical yokes. And that is detention for the rest of the week. Carry on, brush. Thank you, sir. OK, Fox Features, prepare for a hammer. Uh, listen, gentlemen, I'm sure this can be sorted out in a perfectly civilised manner. <laughs> I mean, uh, who can blame me? Your lady friends are all so beautiful. Yeah? And now I see they have such good taste in men, I wouldn't dream of poaching. <laughs> I mean, uh, we're all men of the world, eh? <laughs> I've seen him on telly. He does that talking dog programme. He's quite funny. Is he? I am. So, uh, how about we draw a line under this little misunderstanding, have a gentlemanly game of footy? Hmm? Yeah. yeah. Good man. Eat my gold. <laughs> Rush! <laughs> uh, uh. If the road to victory seems just out of reach, it's time to take emergency steps and try a different path. No fine. <laughs> yes? Really? I'm sorry, Headmaster. Okay. Yeah, maybe we should. 9 30? Certainly, Headmaster. Bye. <laughs> Basil. What? That was the head on the phone. So? Seems you're in a bit of trouble. And? And? He's asked me to go in to see him. Tomorrow. Whatever. I'm going skateboarding in the park with my new mates. Oh, you are not a man. You're grounded. Go. Now go to your room. You can get an early night. I hate you. Our science teacher has invented an acid that can burn through anything. Now he's just trying to invent something to keep it in. Oh. 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 Oh, thanks for coming with me, Madison. I need the support. Well, anything to help Basil? <laughs> Basil needs all the help he can get. It's double chemistry this morning. Well, you could come on the bus with Madison and me. No way! So embarrassing! I'm going off with the other kids, Dave, Moll and Lucy. Come on, Lucy. Come on, Basil. <laughs> so, you are the parents? Uh, Carer. Forward slash girl upstairs. <laughs> Maybe this complex domestic setup has something to do with Brush's behavior. But it's not affected Molly. And Dave's perfectly normal. Apart from being a 14 year old billionaire who lives with a talking fox. Yeah, apart from that. <laughs> so you see, the acetic acid in the vinegar reacts with the sodium bicarbonate, producing CO2. Now, this is a very basic chemical reaction. You see, the molecules... I is... have a reaction to chemicals. La, la, la. They send me to sleep. <laughs> <laughs> boom, boom! 
In addition to his general lack of interest in class, there's his overall scruffiness. Not to mention the messing about, flirting with girls. It's me! 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 Causing trouble. Civil play? You can't fall asleep in my class! Truancy. Rush! <laughs> Food fights. <laughs> Sodium is a very volatile substance. On contact with H2O, it produces a violent chemical reaction, causing an explosion. Hmm? Explosion? Now, that's more like it. This science is a bit more interesting. Now, in the dishes in front of you, you'll find a lump of sodium. Now, under no circumstances must the sodium come into contact with... Look, Davy boy, sodium. It's highly explosive. <laughs> then there's the breaking of the windows. A pirate's favourite school subject. Art. Boom boom. <laughs> Refurbishment ahead. Study. Stained glass window. Rebuilding a chemistry wing. Etc. Etc. Ah, total. Five hundred ninety-seven thousand two hundred and fifty-six quid and thirty-seven p. The 37p was for the chocolate bar I had when I broke the vending machine. <laughs> it's only money. At least you're not being investigated by social services like me and Madison. You're being threatened with the orphanage, like me. Or having to set up a counselling service for all those young, broken hearts. Yeah, I wouldn't pay it if I were you, Dave. <laughs> me pay it? <laughs> you're the only one with any money, old son. It would have been cheaper to have sent me to Barbados for this episode. You've got to be joking, Basil. Why would if I... I might interrupt, Dave. It wasn't my idea to go back to school. It was yours. Yeah, but... And for that, you must bear the consequences. Now, about the script for next week's show, I thought I might sit it in the seashells. <laughs> Any objections? Everybody else. 